says that I am a bit against doing Doom 3. It's first person. But anyway, um, it's a good idea just to do these little one shots or one or series that are just going to recur every now and then. But the reason I'm going to this one again and Love for Deadwell is because I want to talk about the other, other possible games. Another one I have in mind is Skyrim, but there's two negatives there. One, first person. Two, it's a you know open world game, and I'm not sure if I'm ready to go into those yet. Because those would take forever for me to even do a Let's Play of, or complete. However, it is a major contender in that area, so yeah. And as you can see, I'm playing as Freddy for this. And I'm going to go with Easy, again. And wait, didn't we go Medium last time? Uh, oh well, we're going with Easy this time. Okay, let's let the uh, games begin. And it's Sub-Zero first. Cool. I get to face off against Sub-Zero. And I got the fatalities here. Just so I'm ready. I have no idea who's doing the voice here, but I'm positive it's not Jack Earl Haley, Jackie Earl Haley who played the part in the recent remake. And if so, they could have at least gotten... If they couldn't get Jack Earl Haley, they could have made... Like Robert Anglin and got Robert Anglin or something. The only connection I think he even has to uh, Mortal Kombat is, well, Warner Brothers owns him and I guess they wanted to try to do some sort of a crossover with Warner Brothers character. Molly Pro and I guess they went with him rather than uh, any other character because, well, for one, Freddy kind of fits. You know, the supernatural thing that the Mortal Kombat series has, has going for it. But where Jason doesn't, Jason may be a zombie, but he doesn't really fit in with Mortal Kombat. Finish him. Okay, you guys ready? Okay, it says... I was trying to do, uh, tell him Freddy sent you. But it says you can do it anywhere. I think it's wrong. <laughs> I think, uh, the uh, actual game is lying to me. I think this guide I'm looking up is lying. Yeah, I think this guide is actually lying to me, guys. I really don't know if it is or not. I'm actually hoping Freddy does come back, because that would be awesome. But if not Freddy, uh, maybe a DC Comics character. Like, I don't know. I mean, because they already got Injustice. Uh, so it's possible. Uh, maybe, uh, not Raven, but I was thinking maybe Batman? Or the Joker, maybe. Actually, what are my moves? I'm kind of curious. Okay, Hell Spike. Okay, let me try that. Okay, I get it, because Freddy is... No, actually, no way, I don't get it. Wait, he actually did toss his glove in one of the movies, I think. No, wait, somebody tossed his glove at him, if I remember correctly. I forget which of the movies that was, but someone actually took off his glove and tossed it at him. It might have been Freddy's dead, actually. Which is, of course, one of the uh, Anglins movies. Not uh, the recent... Actually, I'm surprised the remake hasn't gotten a sequel yet. It's... Okay, you guys ready? Up, down, left, right. Let's try it again. Up, down. What? Oh, man, I can't even do the fatality show these off. I literally want to show the fatalities off, because that would be awesome. 
Some of the fatalities in this game are pretty freaking cool. You know, they're not as cool as the ones that were in the originals, but, uh... I'm actually surprised they didn't give Jax his old, uh, you know, MK2 look, where he didn't have arms. Yeah, there was a point in history where Jax didn't have them. On the bright side, uh, DC versus Mortal Kombat. DC Universe versus Mortal Kombat, or Mortal Kombat versus DC Universe. No longer canon, guys. It's no longer canon. At all. Thank God. Because that game, from I played it for like a, a second, and it sucked. Okay, I played it for more than a second. I rented it. Thank God I rented it, and I never actually decided to buy it. Okay, you want me to finish him? Alright. Okay, let me look at this up. What the? I was trying, okay? I'm trying, guys. I really am trying. <sighs> These see... I'm not sure. Are you supposed to do them qu I forget. Are you supposed to do them quickly or do them slowly? I'm going to try one more time. But, uh, one more fatality, okay? You know, being an actor, Johnny must be worried out to see uh, someone who's supposed to just be a uh, movie character fighting him. Unless uh, Freddy exists in the Mortal Kombat universe. Because I would assume that the Nightmare on Elm Street movies exist in this universe. And Freddy isn't real. And again, this is a universe where, there, where Johnny Cage has done a movie called Ninja Mime. So, who knows? Who knows if New Line Cinema even existed? Freddy. New Line Cinema being the company that has produced the Nightmare on Elm Street series since it debuted in 1984. In fact, before they made that mo before they made it Elm Street, they used to be a distribution company. In fact, it was their s only. I think it was either their third or second ever that they produced internally. Okay, it does. I am looking these up because apparently I think I got them wrong. What do you know? I did get him wrong. Okay, I'm looking it up right now, guys, and I apparently got it wrong. Here's I here's IGN guys, their vitality list. Wait, was this before Freddy was added? Cause I just don't see him listed. Yeah, it must have been before Freddy was added. Okay, here we go. Freddy Krueger. And here's his, uh... Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they still got it wrong. Granted, I kind of get what, what, what they're trying to do. I'm gonna look it up, just so I could, uh... Oh, 
Okay, it's Susan. All right, here we go. And actually, yeah, this is a reference to uh, Street One, where Johnny. This happens to Johnny Depp in that movie. But the name of it is uh, well, tell him Freddy sent you, which is a reference to Nightmare on Elm Street Part Four. Uh, a character named Kincaid yells. See you in hell. And Freddy says, Tell them Freddy sent ya. Yeah, I always found that line to be kind of corny, but remember, the guy who's saying it has made more cornball references ever. Police brutality coming up. So yeah, I always found that one to be kind of corny, but it's not as bad. It's from Nightmare on Elm Street 3. It's one of my favorite lines. She goes, Hey Jennifer, this is your big break in TV. Welcome to prime time, bitch. It's one of my favorite lines of Freddy, Freddy's ever done. Right next to, You forgot the power glove! Whoa, that has got to be cool. I actually used an x-ray move to get to knock him out. That is kind of awesome. Okay, I'm looking this up, guys. Let me see what we got. We're really gonna try to fight the Masters of Dream, the Master of Dreams. Actually, that was the name of the fourth movie. It was called the Dream Master. We're not sure whether the title refers to refers to a poem that the main sing says, but we're not sure if the title refers to that or Freddy or Alice. I'll try this again. Freddy. Okay, I was this cool. I was trying to tell him Freddy sent you again. Because even though I want to show uh And I just realized that the live capture is no longer on. <laughs> I will admit, Freddy has t one of the two of the best fatalities in the game. I think he has some of the best, at least in my opinion. Uh, that's coming from a long-time Mortal Kombat fan. And even if I wasn't able to pull off the fatalities back in the day, I have seen them. Are you shitting me? Are you shitting me? I'm gonna try to get another episode done today of probably Scorpion or maybe Luke Ken. But I'm also thinking of doing an episode that's just going to be mostly the fatalities from the practice, fatality practice set. Freddy, Freddy. Round three, fight. Finish. Yeah. 
Okay, ready? I'm trying to do the fatalities, guys. You have my word there. I am trying to do them. Okay, I'm kind of a bit of a fan of the fact that he just, like, splurts his little blood at there. Okay, Cyber Sub-Zero. This ought to be actually pretty cool. <laughs> if only because, uh, well, I still am going to try I'm going to do Tell Him Freddy Sent you again. If only... What makes it cool is the fact that he's going to have a different color blood than anyone else in the, in the game, in the series. Okay, you put an ice ball near my... Ouch! Actually, that would probably hurt. Well, I'm not sure. Can Freddy be hurt? Uh, oh yeah, he can be, but if you, only if you bring him into the real world. Are we in the real... Oh yeah, I think we are. Technically, I think uh, Outworld does count as the real world. Never mind. So unless Sub-Zero fell asleep, uh, we're, we're shit out of luck. Okay, you guys ready? Okay, I thought I could pull it off. I didn't. I really didn't. On the bright side, you get, you get to see another different color, that he has different color blood than anyone else in the game, so yeah. Okay, he's kicking my ass. Freddy yep, Freddy wins, motherfucker. Okay, you guys ready? And now we can do a fatality again. Ready? One, two, and... It's almost as if I'm killing myself. Because I never... He never changed form back into Shane soon. So it's kind of awkward. Woohoo! Look at that, man. That is awesome. I wish I could put that on instant replay, but I can't. <laughs> Cause that'd be awesome to have on a replay. In fact, I wish I could. Ha I wish they would let you turn that into a GIF, so I could uh, send it to people or make it an avatar or something. Cause that'd be awesome. <laughs> okay, I have to face Kentaro again. Okay, then what's the criteria for facing Goro then? I never was able to figure that out.
Okay, that is becoming bullshit. Okay, guys, I got. Well, I think I can use it. I'm showing how shitty I am sometimes at this game, but it's not my fault. Blame him. Okay! He actually used the x-ray move before- uh, his x-ray before I could use mine. That's sad. And he kicked my ass again. Finish him. Okay, I'm gonna try again, guys. This ain't gonna be as long as the last one, I hope. Okay, here we go again. I don't believe this. Okay, Kintara won. Again. I don't believe this. Do I have any moves I can use other than that one? And once again, I had my ass kicked. Great. Okay, I'm gonna try one more time, guys. Because I'm not letting this...
Anyway, guys, I'm gonna try this one more time. How do you avoid that? Never occurred to me to figure that part out. And I think we got him. Finally! We got Kentaro! Yeah! We got him! Woohoohoo! Great! He's going to kick my ass again. Granted, uh, three rounds is not a bad thing. Three. Fight! And Shao Kahn, by the way, for case anyone ever figured out that's who's narrating. Or at least it was Shao Kahn in the original, not in the original, I think it was Shane Soon saying it. In the, in the later games, it is Shane Soon, it's Shao Kahn who says, fight, round one, fight, that kind of stuff. I think I said it, I could be wrong, I mean, I could be wrong about that. I mean, I don't, like I said, I don't have any proof about that. I mean, I just always assume that's... Uh, no, wait, I do have proof. That's so, what someone I heard on the web say. It was Shang Tsung that said that. Kintaro wins. But this is getting frustrating as all hell, guys. <laughs> Seriously, it's getting frustrating. Okay, I tried that. We got him! Woohoohoo! Sorry for going quiet, I was just trying to focus. Him. Next up should be Shao Kahn, actually. He's actually going to be harder than Kentaro was. Freddy wins. Yeah, it's weird to think. There's going to be someone harder than that. Than this. And it's the main guy. The Emperor. I'm actually surprised that's what, not what they call him here. They should have just said Emperor Shao Kahn, not just Shao Kahn. I mean, he has a title, you know, you could put it in there. Then again, by that logic, they should have been uh, Shang Tsung's title, Wizard Shang Tsung.
going to take back what I said about it being hard. It was, but it's not. It's okay, I take it back. It is hard still. I take it back. I really take it back. Never mind. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh crap. Finish it. You suck. Feel the wrath of Shao Kahn. <laughs> that's all he says. You that's that was his entire fatality, just taunting me? Seriously. Seriously? Screw you. <laughs> Round one. Fight. Guess do this. Ow. I know there are some DC fans who hate Mortal Kombat just because of that game that happened. Uh, I'm not one of them. I'm a DC fan, but I don't hate Mortal Kombat c just because of one game. They didn't screw up DC Universe, believe it or not. Mortal Kombat is still a great game. Okay, Shao Kahn wins. Yep, I don't believe this. Get my ass kicked. I should wait. There are signs there are times when you can actually fight him. The things I've been doing. Are not one of them, believe it or not. <sighs> okay, we're gonna keep trying, guys. I'm going to defeat Shao Kahn. What takes me forever? <sighs> Too bad you can't actually, you know, do a fatality on these guys. I would love to, because that would be awesome in my mind. The day I bow to you is the day I lick my own testicles. Sorry to discuss you there, guys. Actually, I think his hands never really. Is this? I think his hand did that in one of the movies. Oh yeah, it was Wes Craven's new nightmare. His hand actually did crawl on like that right at the very beginning, and then the animatronic hand they were working on crawls along and actually kills somebody. On the but it's not good. It's only taking us three rounds. I mean, three tries.
Okay, here we go, guys. X-ray. And we did it! We kicked Shao Kahn's ass! We win! Woohoo! Cutscene, guys. So here we go. It's gonna shut up right now. Freddy Krueger's bladed hands tore through Shao Kahn. The demonically enhanced weapons had been more than a match for the Emperor's dark magic. Though Freddy had saved Earthrealm, Nightwolf recognized him as an evil spirit, and in a shamanistic ritual, sent him back to the Dream Realm. But that decision proved ruinous. Freddy did not resist. He welcomed a return to immortality. From the dream realm, he will again create a nightmare in Earth realm. Okay, I have to admit, I like that little last part. I mean, because it looks just like the poster for the original poster for uh, Nightmare on Elm Street. The original theatrical poster. And I should know I've seen the poster. It's on the DVD cover. Anyway, guys, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys uh, for another episode of this. And then one or two episodes of Left 4 Dead 2. So, yep. See you guys then.